What's up guys, Leak here, and on my uh, other video I just uploaded, yes it was about to change, but it did not have audio, I was recording without audio, so I just wanted to make a new one, so here we go, um, go to MoGraph, Cloner, and as Cloner comes up, hold Alt, and go to this little block and go sweep nerbs, and next hold Shift, and drag a rectangle, and size this down to about 250 125 rounding check um, XY to XZ and angle to 6 okay now after this uh, hold no actually don't hold anything just um bring up a circle wait yeah 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 yeah, yeah you're gonna have to click on sweep nerves hold shift circle and as you can see from the top view it's way too big so scale this down to about, uh, I'm thinking, 15. Yeah, 15. Okay. And next, uh, where is it? Uh, okay, so. Now we have 15. Guys, okay, here we go. So now, one, uh, I click on cloner. And click on sweep nerves and then put this under. On. Uh, yeah, okay, that's right. So now I click on cloner and change y to 0 and then x to 150. And I think I messed up. Yeah, this is not supposed to be in here. Let's see, there we go, there we go, there we go. Okay. So if cloner is inside, you just, at the start of the video, you just want to hit MoGraph and then cloner, and then you just want to start off with rectangle and then uh, sweep nerve. So if you did it my way, leave it there, but all you have to do is just drag it out and bring it to the uh, the left. So now, once you have this, click on sweep nerves and drag it under cloner. Uh, click on cloner and change X to 150 and rotation to 90. And now as you can see, you have the chain right here, okay? And to change the position of like the rotation, uh, just click on um, cloner again, and you can just change it by the rotation. So that goes that way, up and down, just like that. So here's a tutorial on how to make this, and the chains, and if you want to add the count, just add it on. And it goes in its own direction like that. So I'll render out a final image for you. Um, it's a pretty awesome Lightroom. It's a Melon's Lightroom. It's pretty neat. So let me render out and I'll pause the video and show you the final picture. Okay, here you go. Here's the final image of the chains. And I will have a link to Melon's GFX pack um, for you to have the Light Studio in it without the chains. So you have to make it yourself because of the tutorial. So. I hope you guys enjoyed, and leave a like because I never saw a chain tutorial yet, and I believe that this is the first one that is actually good, so yeah, peace.